sala 1 is a technology enabled network of ophthalmology clinics that attends more than 20,000 patients per month. This is not nearly enough what we need to solve the eye care problem around the world. What we're doing is integrating technologies to make sure that we have a platform that can scale very quickly to solve this problem globally. Eye care should not be um, I care should not be a, a something that people, uh, it, it, should, it should be a right. Um, globally, I care um, is one of the largest problems that we have in the world. It's the first or second cause of impairment in most emerging markets. 90% of the problem is happens in emerging markets and that's where the problem needs to be solved. Um, what we're trying to do is put small incremental technology improvements to solve processes, to solve um, how we attract demand to be able to solve a large problem that affects millions and millions mm. of people around the world. So these are some selected examples of what we're doing. We have a mobile application uh, that is integrating primary care physicians and opticians to send patients to ophthalmology using gaming systems. We're use, this, this is growing at 30% per month, the number of referrals that we're receiving. Telemedicine is integrating how we do diagnostics uh, we're rolling this out in 11 of our clinics and hope to see 30% of our patient volume using telemedicine by December. We're also using artificial intelligence to detect di diabetic retinopathy and cataracts, and we have a partnership with Microsoft to uh, develop these algorithms. Today, these algorithms have a 96% specific specificity, uh, and we can detect patients without the need of any uh, trained personnel. Just with technical staff, we can do it. In the future, what we want to do is integrate the whole customer journey or the whole patient journey using artificial intelligence, <clears throat> all the way from triage to intelligent pricing. To solve this problem, one of the main things that we need to do is give people loans and be able to have people pay out in, over installments for their payments. Governments aren't solving this problem, so patients are paying out of pocket, and we need to give them financing to be able to do it and do it in a way that is effective for them. Our team has been working for more than eight years together to solve this problem, and we have a lot of traction. We've raised capital from IFC and other venture capitals and private equities, but the reality is that without a technology partner that can help us scale this fast, we will not be able to solve the problem globally. Mm. Uh, capital is limited. <laughs> Brains are limited, and this is why we need to work with MIT to solve this amazing and very pressing problem for the world. Thank you.